Um, I um, am 100% service connected PTSD and uh, I suffered that as a result of my military service. I worked as a speech and language pathologist and with PTSD you, you can't shove it down. You have to deal with it and if, it, if you don't deal with it, it metastasizes. Um, shortly after I started the studio, I started having some veterans that came to me for yoga and um, for some healing work on a private basis. And I recognized the symptoms of them experiencing PTSD because I had researched that topic. And, um, but I, so I used my experience and uh, through yoga postures, breathing exercises, meditation, um, they really showed rapid improvement in their sleep, in their calmness, uh, ruminating about the uh, experiences that they had witnessed. What the, the main reason I chose yoga was to help me with meditation. With, with PTSD, you have a lot of replaying tapes in your head. To put some weight on the front leg bones. You know, that's a big part of PTSD. And I'm hoping that meditation will help me with that, help me to get away from that, you know, uh, so much, and and uh, uh, help me to, to I guess eventually not go there again. But but the meditation is probably, and then the yoga. You know, I I I'm, I, I love anything to do with physical uh, intervention or whatever, you know, exercise and stuff. The uh, VA was very very accommodating, very open to receiving our ways of teaching the veterans. So we started in, uh, on February 20th, each Friday, um, I go and teach and some of my students also show up with me to be able to make sure that everybody's safe in class to help with modifications, because not every person can do every posture. So we specialize in modification of every pose for everybody as well came about a, uh, a uh, program that is about an hour or so long for the veterans. It's a consistent program, same identical yoga postures, uh, postures each time, uh, after positive affirmations, uh, some energy medicine techniques, aromatherapy, um, kind of combine all of those things to help the veteran feel better. And they always have something to practice when they leave the class so that Throughout the day, they practice some sort of mindfulness exercise. Uh, I had been praying for some kind of uh, intervention, uh, w asking for God's wisdom. And and uh, two weeks ago, I went to bed and I woke up and I just felt so much lighter. And I don't know, I'm sure it, this has something to do with it, you know, as far as giving me some kind of peace. And I found that I, I, I can get peace, but, but this, but I, you know, I think it's a combination of everything. You know, the trust that you have in here with these therapists and the unconditional acceptance, you know, of, of you as a human being. And so I, I just, uh, you know, that's, that's what, that's my fuel. That's what keeps me going. Most veterans are hesitant and um, skeptical about such programs because sometimes it just doesn't make sense to the mind. What I like to do is to invite as many veterans as possible to venture out and try it because there's, there's, uh, there's nothing to lose and yoga does work.